Hello everybody, my name is Nick and you're watching for the latest unboxing video for the Nanlite Pixavant 18 Mark II. Now first thing that we see when we open the box, wrist strap and the power charger, or actually power adapter, with the nice, nice uh, 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 sticky tape, so this is uh, very useful, because uh, it will help us uh, with cable management. And then here we have the actual wand itself. So, uh, as you can see here, we have uh, quite a lot of LEDs. There are three types of LEDs. There's uh, white LEDs, which give harsh light, SMD LEDs, which give soft light, and RGB LEDs, which all obviously give R RGB uh, light. CRI rating is uh, 95. Uh, when it comes to the lumens, it gives out uh, 1421 lumens at uh, uh, 5 1600 kelvins at uh, 2700 the kelvins it gives out uh, 99 laxes at 2 meters at uh, 6500 kelvins it gives out 117 laxes at 2 meters now this thing is uh, also does not come with the battery but we could mount MPF battery right here as you can see you just slide it in the slot when you want to remove it, just press this button and then you uh, are freeing it. When it comes to the cooling, it only has a passive cooling, which is a plus and a minus. Not really that big of a minus, it doesn't really hit that much, so that's not really that uh, big of an issue. But uh, it is a plus because it's uh, silent. Uh, when it comes to this side, as you can see, we have here a small thread. This is uh, pretty much the same as on the uh, tripods, but it's not for a tripod. You have a small notch in the top and uh, you just hold it like so. You open it and then you just screw in the screw. And now we have barn doors. Barn doors do not come included, unfortunately. Then here we have a standard thread. This is so that we could mount it on a tripod, be it a light tripod with the uh, standard one fourth uh, thread or just a regular uh, photo video tripod. So, uh, when it comes to the build quality, the barn doors are obviously metal and this is plastic but it's pretty pretty good. Uh, on this side when we want to turn it on we hold it for a short bit and want to turn it uh, into the RGB. Uh, now it's uh, shuffling colors, uh, shuffling colors faster even so. And then here we have the ability to change the actual hue. It has 360 uh, different hues, it goes between 0, which is uh, totally red, and 360, which is again totally red, as you can see. And then when we want to turn it into a white again, we just press the button. Uh, now this is turning between 5600 and 3200 kelvins. Now who is this for? Well, well uh, if you are looking uh, for a light source that's not really that big, which uh, can use MPF batteries, which is always a good thing. Uh, also something that will give you both soft and harsh light and RGB abilities. I think this is definitely an option for you. So this is primarily for like shooting as more clips where you have this uh, need for RGB lights mostly, but uh, also for just uh, removing any shadows and things like that, uh, or just having a very very cool effects. So if you are shooting a music video or something like that, definitely a good uh, good tool. Also, if you are shooting a promo clip or anything of that nature, uh, where you do have uh, this need for. Uh, effects which this will give you. 
then this is obviously a very very good option indeed. You are watching Photolit, uh, if you enjoyed this video leave a like, comment and subscribe. Until the next time, goodbye.